Hello everybody. Uh, I'm back. This is my second video. Uh, you didn't see me in the first, but you're going to be lucky and see me in the second one. Um, oh, Bandit, what's up? You want up here? Come here, baby. Come here. No. Anyway. Uh, as I said earlier, I have been sick all week from this cortisone, so hopefully I'll be better as time goes on. Ron's waving in the background. I can see him. He's a <laughs> I eventually will get him into my videos. He thinks not, but I think so. The only thing is he'd probably steal the whole show because he's such a handball. Okay, well, I also went to the Dollar Tree today. I hadn't been there in mm, probably a couple weeks. So I bought, I actually bought a bunch of food items, so uh, I don't feel real bad, but I was trying to stock up on snacks for the weekend. So anyway, uh, I don't know where my um, tripod is. I'm sure it's somewhere in the bedroom, but I couldn't find it. So, a box of Hungry Jack Cheesy Scallop Potatoes is propping up the phone. And I bought two of them. And these are the family size, which I thought was pretty incredible for a buck. I almost bought the other kind, too. And I thought, nah, I'll just make these. I just don't have the room for all these things. Uh, I'm telling you what. I just, I don't. I bought a box of these Toast and pop them. Toast them pop-ups, the frosted cookies and cream, because Anna from Only In My Dreams recommended them, and then somebody else bought them because she recommended them and said they were real good. So I figured we'll try them, you know, probably more for a snack than for breakfast. I don't know. It don't look like a breakfast kind of thing that I would eat. So hold on. Sorry, Bandit had to be in the uh, mix of things. Lord forbid if we've been gone for several hours and uh, Mary, she's my next door neighbor out here. She called me and I said, did, did you find my puppy wandering around? She goes, yes, I did. I picked him up and da, da, da. But anyway, she came over and got him and was taking him for a walk and everything because he gets very sad when we're gone. He wants this really bad, but I found this and it matches. This is the color of my purse. So I got this for my purse. I guess I'll just stick it in my butt because he'll probably chew it. He loves anything fuzzy or, well, I should, well, you didn't, I didn't post that video yet, but I had gotten this little rug and I gave it to him and he's tearing the heck out of it. Okay. So I, inside the refrigerator, we have two jellos with fruit in it. I just went ahead and put them away. Um, I was happy to see that they had the, um, Chex Mix. I didn't see the honey one, but I didn't care because I don't like that kind. Um, I got two of the traditional. And I mean, that's a pretty good size bag. This is a uh, more than a dollar. You know, it'd be way more than a dollar to buy in the store. It's eight, uh, almost nine ounce bag, 8.75. So I'm sure they'd be about three bucks in the store. And I got a um, one of the bold ones. I got two of the traditional and one bowl. That's like one of my all-time favorite snacks. So, he's still wondering where the uh, fuzzball went to. And then I had gotten at Aldi today uh, the olive tapenade hummus, which I love. And so they had the little bags of the, these are much smaller than the other um, seven days a week brand was, but I got the bagel chips to dip into my hummus. And I'm just putting everything right back in the bag because nosy butt won't get out of it. And then it was kind of funny because when Ron came up, he had these two containers of the jello out of the refrigerator section, and I had this one here. So I said, Well, I guess we're we're both craving jello. I could make it, but gosh, I'm so lazy. 
Actually, my favorite you buy at a grocery store here called Town & Country is called Raimundo. And uh, I love that jello. It's got the texture of it is really great, you know. Um, I buy the snack packs at Dollar Tree, but which is a name brand, but I don't like the texture. It's not Raimundo's tastes exactly like as if you just made jello. Uh, the snack pack tastes more like firmer. I don't know. How, I don't know how to explain it. I don't like it as well. Let's put it that way. And I bought and tore up the bag. Um, goodness. A box of, I just keep picking them up because we go through them like crazy anyway, of the 160 Scotties. They had them on sale at the grocery store the other day for 120 for 99 cents. And I'm like, I got you beat, buddy. Um, I found the soft lips. And they had tons of them. If I would have had more money, I'd have bought more of them. But I bought five of them. Um, I love soft lips, and I like this one in particular. So I bought these for Ron, some pens. They're the Special Edition Super Smooth Advanced Ink Premium Metal Barrel. 1.0 millimeter medium black ink. Um, I bought this for moi. It is a little jot planner for 2018. And I like how it's made. It'll be just great for my purse. And it, yet it's got big enough things. So if I'm at a meeting or something, I can write down, you know, whatever I need to write down. Because it appears I've been made, I've been made for the Outside prison ministry group that I'm in called Coney, they made me or selected me, voted me in, however you want to say it, their um, spiritual director or spiritual leader or whatever. And then for the weekend coming up where the ladies will come, I am the head spiritual person. So I guess I'm going to have a lot of meetings. Plus, I have um, school starting in. I think in September, so yeah, I, I'm going to take one class and one only, and then two in the spring. Uh, these I'm going to get out, so maybe the dog will leave me alone. Uh, I got him two balls. I I keep buying balls and they get lost, but I bought him these. I thought we could play with them outside. Now, I don't know if he's going to be able to get his little, I guess he can get his little jaws around him. I don't know. Bandit, look. Look, Bandit. Uh, he's a little dog. He got it. Good job, little fart knocker. Um, I bought these. They didn't have very many left. I saw Karen, K is for Karen, haul these. What do they say? Zoo on them. I got little paw prints and stuff. Um, I bought these to have out here. I believe they'll fit my feet. Uh, because when it gets cold in the fall, I don't, I never have any slippers out here. I, whatever I used to have, I don't know what happened to them. And I like that they have black, the grippy black bottoms because it's always dirty out here, so, even in the fall. So I got me a pair of $1 slippers. And let's see, more soft lips. Um, I got this, this to put a picture in. This one is R for Ron. And... Um, I bought two of these. Here's one of them. I already had bought four of them and took them home, but these are, I brought these to keep out here. Uh, the LED lights, I thought I'd start switching them out to LED out here. And I saw when I was writing um, a mark or a message on my dry erase board that uh, my marker's just about biting the dust, so I bought three new ones. Okay. In this bag, I have three purple bushes. I have some purple and flowers outside. Um, and it, I have them in an old um, 
like a little carrying, wooden carrying tool thing. And the back side needed some more fullness, so I bought three more. That's probably the extent of my, I've planted seeds and stuff. I, I think I'm done for the, for the summer. Um, I've been having bad sinus headaches, so I bought two of these. Um, I went cuckoo and bought myself this. I have a thing that has my pens in it, but I just thought this was so cute and pink and glittery, and it's a lot bigger than the other one I have, so I can get all my markers and everything in there. So I got that. And I, I like that it has the three-ring thing, although I don't I'll ever use a three-ring binder, but you never know. I might. Um, uh, I bought I have makeup at home. But I don't want to carry it back and forth and back and forth. Oh, oh, he's got my slippers. Bandit, bring him here. How do you get the slippers? Bring him here, baby. Bring him here. He likes my slippers. Play with your ball. Or what's that? Anyway, I don't want to bring it. And I don't wear makeup that often, but occasionally I thought I might want to. So I just picked up a kind of neutral palette of um, L.A. Colors eyeshadow. And uh, I got some other stuff. I bought a black mascara. Actually, the one I have at home is uh, yeah, for sensitive eyes. But we'll try this one. And I have... What else in here? I bought two cute. Can you, honey, can you grab that? Hold on. Okay. Oh, we had to get my slippers. Um, I got two Q-tips for home. I bought two letters like this. One is a J for me. Um. Because I thought it'd be cute when I, you know, ever get my craft stuff ever back together. I bought an M for my name for watching Little Bonehead. Um, I bought some Velcro because I thought you never know when I might need. I've used it in campers before for things, so I thought then I'll have it on hand. This is the first time I ever saw the Butcher Boy, uh, Coconut oil. They had several of them. I just picked up one. I don't even know if I'll. I don't know. I don't use it. At Sarah, my daughter Sarah uses it, but I just bought it. And um, I bought one of these because it's nice and small and handy. I have quite a few little chopping handy. And I only I found these. I bought three of them. Uh, these are the ones I like. There was one I didn't like. So this is the one with all the owls and stuff. I know you guys. I'm sure some of you guys. I've seen them being hauled already. And then it has the gems, pink gems. It's like three sheets here. It says there's 80 count stickers. And then I got the teal colored things. And then it says flower power. It's hard to show this one, the glare. And then this one here. And then the green gems and that. And then that. That's the only, the only stickers I bought. I, we never have hardly any stickers, so it's not that big of a deal. When we do, you know, they have a little bit, they just always have a dribbling. Like last time I went, they had washi tape, but they didn't really have anything new. They did have these, which I've never seen before. It said sentiment, sentiment, sentiment stickers, and they're in gold, and they're, and I, there's no way I can get the glare off this really very well. But there are words like yippee, love, good job. I love these things for pocket letters. 
or if I'm doing an ATC card, it's kind of nice to have a little word on it. So, uh, yeah, I got those. I thought those were kind of different. All right. Almost done, guys. I'm sure Ron would be happy to. All right, I bought myself a little bag of veggie chips because I love them. Me and Sarah Slate, or Clara Slate. Uh, I got a French onion dip. I don't know if any of these are any good, but I thought we would try it. And I got a can of jalapeno cheddar dip, which I do believe we bought before. And I think it was okay. Because I couldn't find what I wanted at all. They didn't have what I was looking for. All right. And this might be the last day. Um, they have their calendars out. And I had actually seen this online and about had a stroke. So I heard it and got it. It says, love the journey. How could you not love the flamingo? And on the back, there's other ones. It says, stand tall, darling. Be honest, be silly, be kind. Love the little things. Wake up and make up. Let your light shine. Act like a, act like a lady. Think like a boss. Be a flamingo in a flock of pigeons. Be a pineapple, stand tall, wear a crown, and be sweet. And there's one with a bike, and it says, love the journey. Be yourself, everyone else is already taken. They may forget what you said, but they will never forget how you made them feel. Silent night, holy night. And this is the different pictures. And I will try to frame them somehow. The... It's hard to come by square frames, but I'll see what I can do. Some of these I'll put in here. I like the Silent, silent Night, Holy Night. I think that's with the plaid trees. That's very awesome. So I got that. Um, I got this lip gloss to try sparkling lip gloss in rosette. That's to go with my makeup out here. And I will show you the color here. This is all still that um, beauty benefits they were, they had another, they had more of it out. I don't know if they keep getting more or. It smells good. I can't figure out what it smells like, but. And for me, this is perfect. Oh, maybe I should do it in a different way. <laughs> I'm having a hard time, guys. It's it's really not very dark, but it's really fine for what I want. It doesn't feel a little sticky or anything either, so that's a good thing. Because nothing is worse than sticky, sticky stuff on your lips. All right, almost done. Got a jalapeno cheddar cheese flavored cheese in a little container like this. There we go. Kick the box. Another soft whip. Um, here's the J like that. And an applesauce for me and Ron. And I got another baked bean. I know I have some, but I think I'm going to make um, baked beans and smoked sausage and not like a casserole. Maybe I'll throw it in the micro uh, microwave, in the uh, crock pot. And I believe that is it for my haul for the Dollar Tree. So, hope you're having a great day. Actually, it's a great night at this point. And, um, 
Oh, I hope I will be feeling much better next week and I'll be able to do a lot more than I've been doing. And you guys uh, have a great weekend. Have fun. And uh, it's 50s weekend out here, so um, yeah. So I'm going to be doing the old watching the band. Ten actually, tonight. At about 8 or 8.30, they have a drive-in movie, and it's going to be Grease. Um, I'm not sure if we'll go down and watch it. You, you literally drive your your golf cart up, or you can get to, however, and sit on lawn chairs and stuff. Um, I don't know if we'll do that. The people next door will probably have a fire. I don't know. We'll do something, though. So anyway, I will talk to you guys later. I love you long time. Stay crafty. Thanks for coming around and coming back all the time and see you in my next video.